All right, hello everyone. So today we are going to be playing a game called Milk Inside a Bag of Milk Inside a Bag of Milk. So just for a small description on the game, it says a short story about what sort of challenges everyday little things can be. Help the girl buy milk. Be the first not to disappoint her. This game is a small visual novel showing either funny abstractions and wordplay or painful psychological episodes. The claim that history is based on real events will be too specific, so it is easier to pretend that it is just a set of abstractions and wordplay. First of all, this is an artistic manipulation with word and form, only then a game. So without further ado, let's see what milk inside a bag of milk inside a bag of milk is about. So it says, help me buy milk. Sure, why not? Write down your name. Oh, I don't have a name. I'll just put black. Okay, I'm on my way to the store. We're re-rehearsing the speech. I haven't been out for so long that I've forgotten what words they say when they enter the store. I'm on my way to the store. Who are you talking to? Shut up and go. Okay, who are you talking to? I imagine being a game character. What if it helps to gather my thoughts? Okay, what game? Well, you know. There are games in which you can see characters' thoughts right on the screen, you know? So I thought if someone reads my thoughts, then I have to be really concentrated so as not to whip up the extra ha-ha. I'm deeply breathing in. Hello? Can I... Damn, I forgot. <laughs> 19th attempt, and I'm failing again. I bite my lips with annoyance. So, once again. Hello, can I get... Wow, a whole word more. <laughs> oh my god. Thank you, I'm trying really hard. In my opinion, this time the L sound was longer than usual. Is that an L or an I? Do you think this is it? Who knows? H hello? Oh, can I? <sighs> I'd better keep my lips sealed. Ha ha ha, loser, don't worry. Let's be a bit optimistic, so I'm gonna go with don't worry. <laughs> okay. By the way, you have been walking with your left foot on asphalt and your right foot on grass for a whole minute. Oof. What? what My right leg froze in the air. H how much? 50 steps on asphalt and 50 on grass. So oddly specific. You will have to cancel the previous step. <laughs> Uh, how do you imagine it? This is not the first time. You were taught how to do it. Come on. You're so stupid. Um, let's go with the first option. I, I don't remember. I'm going to burst into tears. Oh. <sighs> From the beginning. So. Step one. Take a step back to get your foot exactly into your own trail. Wait, wait, uh, how is it step one? Oh my god. What then? So it's already the 50th second. But wait, if I'm going backwards, then 50th what? It still doesn't make a lot of sense. Okay, okay. Step 50th. Take a step back to get your foot exactly in your trail. 
Could you paraphrase it at least a little? <laughs> you can't just repeat a phrase without changing at least one word. People don't talk like that. You're hopeless. You make it sound like it's my fault. The store closes in an hour, so... You'll be very, very guilty if you do not buy milk. Damn, really? So, are you ready? Yes, yes. I gently changed the position of the leg, peering carefully into the thick grass. Okay. When I entered the store, I asked the very first person I met. Hello, can, can I? Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> that's it? Excuse me, what? Oh. <laughs> um, excuse me, what? Oh. <laughs> what? Excuse me, what? Am I supposed to do something here? He's just saying the same thing over and over again. You'd better not to do it. He is clearly not going to change his lines. You run the risk of falling into an endless loop. Excuse me, what? Oh. <laughs> Excuse me, what? Oh. <laughs> Excuse me, what? Oh. <laughs> what? Oh. What is he trying to tell you? He's trying to scare me, but how does he know that I'm terrified by the letter O? Is that an actually is that actually a thing? I'm so confused. What is so terrible about it? I, I have a frightening image as soon as I imagine it. I can show explaining won't be enough. Okay. Something like that. That took a turn, but I like it though. So I'll just keep on ignoring his question. What? Oh. What? Oh. What? Oh. <laughs> what? Oh. <laughs> I gather all the will into a fist. Oh? <laughs> oh? <laughs> How the fuck do you say that? <laughs> My interlocutor shook and crawled. I think that's how you say it. You just repeat it after him. And it worked. Do it more often. Wait. I said that he crawled, but did he really crawl? Because I don't even look in his direction. When exactly did you say that? Yeah, just now. Personally, I did not hear. You're just trying to distract me. But I know that my words were shown on the screen. Damn, this is like breaking fourth wall shit. I'm standing by the shelves. On the shelves, there are bags of milk. The two of us are standing. And milk lies. Or maybe? Hey, hey, slow down. Do you even remember why you came? To buy milk. So buy. Right here? Oh my gosh. How, in your opinion, should I reply? Hmm. I suppose something like... Not here. Oh my gosh. So, not here. Take the bag and go to the cash desk. You're getting on my nerves. Uh, first option. Let's do that. I guess the first sentence. And you like for spite. Like for spite, don't make a pause before the second one. Want to take away all my small victories? Interesting. I sigh and pull my hand to take milk, or rather a bag of milk inside. 
or rather a bag of milk inside a bag. What the fuck's going on? I'm so fucking confused. Or rather a bag of milk inside a bag of milk. Uh, oh my god. I need some water for this. Or rather a bag of milk inside a bag of milk inside a bag. Jesus Christ. Reception, reception. 15 minutes before store closing. Hurry up. Let me drink some water. I remembered what these games are called. Visual novels. And by the way, the numbers are written there in full, in letters. Our visual novel... <laughs> this is what happens when you read... A lot in the game. <laughs> I can barely talk right now. And by the way, the numbers are written there in full, in letters. Are visual novels worse than books? But authors are not lazy there. And you don't be lazy too. Wait, I thought only your thoughts were visible on screen. Not anymore, so watch your language. <laughs> <clears throat> Anyway, you heard me. Hurry up or there'll be no good at home. Already running. God damn, this game is so bizarre. Hello? C can I get- get milk, please? The hell is that? You have it. Ah. Give. Damn. I put out a weighty bag at the pay desk. Of course, not just a bag, but milk too. Hello, can I get a bag please? No. Please? No. But please, mom will throw me out of the window if I get back without milk. No. <laughs> but why not? Give more oh my gosh but i don't have anything else hey what me hate you you're pathetic pay for milk pay for milk <laughs> really what would i do without you i pull a crumbled cash out of my pocket and give it to the cashier he starts to carefully examine it about two days have passed before he nodded satisfactorily and put a cash in the machine. Thank you. Goodbye. Damn. I'm walking down a familiar street past a gas station. A bag of milk unpleasantly pulls away my hand, reminding me of the times I took physical therapy. By the way, they gave me a bag at the pay machine, so now I'm carrying a bag of milk inside another bag. Please, no, not again. A gas station is getting closer. How are you feeling? Thanks for your interest. I feel like a mile of ice cream. What is that supposed to mean? Oh, pfft. What is that supposed to mean? As if I tell you. But I'm really interested. You're just a weirdo. Well, look. The ratio of water to milk in the volume of air occupied by me is about 30 to 1. What the fuck? I agree. It's not the tastiest ice cream unless you want to drink more than to eat. So the way from the store to the gas station is a stick, and the way from the gas station to home is ice cream. For today's walk, my body will be in every part of this way. Simple maths. I had no fucking idea what she just said there. Okay. I feel movement under my feet. Asphalt grains, petrol stains. I'm trying to keep my balance, and how do people move on something as uneven as the urban plane? Neat, heel, sock. I count every meter of the way I've gone. 
I even closed my eyes for more concentration. <laughs> hey, watch out! Huh? I unconsciously take a sharp step aside. At the same moment, a huge bear sweeps past me with a wild ripple. Hey, I'm walking here. I'm throwing a stumbling peek at the rapidly moving animal. Its red eyes, in turn, look at me with mockery. Did you see that? How brazen. It was a truck. Oh, really? Although, if you think about it, are there bears with eyes on the back of their head? You might have died. What the hell? Come on. Are you saying someone will seriously want to kill an innocent girl carrying a bag of milk? You are sick. The world is cruel and dangerous. Yeah, the world is very cruel. I'm not in the world you are talking about. Oof. Damn. My path continues. If you think about it, the way from the store has one interesting property. In the most bizarre ways, it adjusts to me. When I hurry, all the traffic lights are service, servicefully extinguished. When I want to cry, a cloud appears and pours rain flows that hide my tears. Right now, I feel how the cloud is slowly gathering over my top. I'm sad. Are you sure all this is really happening? And how else? Have you never been visited by the idea that all this is only in your head? The instruction did not say that at all. What instructions? Apparently these pills don't work on me either. Pills have nothing to do with it. Please, I just want to get home and go to bed. I am really, really grateful to you, but please, no more. Fuck. I feel if I keep on talking to her, something's gonna happen, so I'm just gonna stop. You know what? What? Since I am the character in the visual novel, I want to talk to whoever is reading it right now. As you say, this can affect on your recovery in a wrong way. Okay, I'm gonna go with the second option. I don't care. Do you hear it? I squeeze my head with the hands and set a throw block. A thought block. What? <laughs> with the edge of my eye, I notice a small bench. A great place for cliched visual novel monologues. I'm getting closer. Putting a noticeably heavy bag of milk nearby and raising my head to the sky. How is that? Is that the sky? Listen. I'm a little embarrassed. I understand I'm going crazy. Drugs are working less and less effectively, so... Ultimately, things will happen painlessly. I hope. Do you understand what I'm talking about? Oh, I have to type it. I'm gonna put yes. Please write with a capital letter. You ruined the narrative. Oh, I'm sorry. Yes. Really? I must be quite unlike an exemplary protagonist, right? To be honest, I haven't read many visual novels. Sometimes I regret it, because now I need a lot of effort just to distinguish letters and words. Same. <laughs> By the way, if you don't mind, I wouldn't like to say my diagnosis. Let at least you be the one who sees me as I am. Even if I made you up, don't take it away from me, okay? Don't ask me about too much. How stupid is all this? From the very beginning, you followed me, read my delusional thoughts, Heard my stupid conversations. Maybe I seem crazy and weird to you. <laughs> what 
What is it like to see the world with my eyes? Ever since <clears throat> something happened, I only see red everywhere. No, d don't worry about me. I've been used to it for a long time. To be honest, I even forgot what other colors look like. Let it go. <laughs> Damn, that's really sad. Those monsters from the store? They didn't scare me at all because I know they won't hurt me. Sometimes I think they're the ones who are scared. Can you imagine it? By the way, if you want to ask me what happened, please don't. Do you promise? Yes. Really? Do you promise? Yes. Really? <laughs> yes. I'm serious. <laughs> of course, you couldn't not to ask. In the end, I'm just talking to myself. Sooner or later, I would have raised this topic. So you're really wondering what happened to me? Okay. I won't take time. What do you see? What? <laughs> um, what the fuck do I see? I'm gonna just say pink. Are you sure? One way or another, this is my dad. What? How is that your dad? It's just a bunch of pixels. Some of his parts, at least. Okay, that took a turn. We do not have a very difficult family. But despite all the problems, I would never have thought. Sorry, I shouldn't have raised my voice. In general, he threw himself out of the window and died. Um... Uh, Jesus Christ. This is my last memory. Then, a long gap. Holy fuck, that's so morbid. Strange. Very strange. Today is the first time I've been able to buy something from a store without a serious incident. Of course, the medicine helped me. However, I think it's more of your merit. I was thinking all the time, do not screw up in front of the reader. Or, oh my god, what will he think? <laughs> I don't know why I decided to become a character in a visual novel for the sake of going to the store today. But it has clearly borne fruit. Thank you. By the way, I think there are some frameworks in our communication. That's how I like it. <laughs> okay. And yet, I'm so sad lately. I think more and more what my life has become ever since Dad. Well, you understand. Day after day is the same. I've tried so many pills that I can't feel a difference between them anymore. As long as they keep me on my feet, I'm happy. Jesus Christ, this is so morbid. So sad. But you know what? Today is, today is a special day. Because I have you. I want to tell you... S what? It was very rude of you. Oh no. I will not press you. I just advise you, go home. What the fuck happened? I understand. Well, dear reader, let's go. What the fuck? Uh, uh, oh, I'm getting chills. I stop on my floor and hang by the railing. Repeating this action every day, like a ritual, I stop being afraid of heights. The fuck are you gonna do? A few minutes ago, the pills finally came to naught, so I'm just enjoying blissful silence. When I am under the influence of drugs, terrible and unpleasant melodies sound in my head, mixing with the sounds of the world around me. They create a terrible dissonance in my head. 
I turn around and go to my apartment. Um, what the hell is that? Did you bring milk? Oh. Hi, Mom. Did you bring milk? Yes, Mom. Did your new medicine help? Yes, mom. What the fuck? Go to bed. Yes, mom. Oh my god, that gave me chills. What the hell just happened? But yeah, that was milk inside a bag of milk inside a bag of milk.